Jeffy, what are you doing? Jeffy, what are you doing? Why are you dressed like me? Why are you dressed like me? Oh, I get it. Oh, I get it. You're dressed like me, so you're gonna repeat everything I say. You're dressed like me, so you're gonna repeat everything I say. Well, I'm just not gonna get mad. Well, I'm just not gonna get mad. But seriously, why? But seriously, why? Like, take it off. Like, take it off. I'm being serious, Jeffy. I'm being serious, Jeffy. Jeffy, stop it. Jeffy, stop it. Mario, calm down. He's just having fun. But he's being stupid. But he's being stupid. Mario. I guess you're right. I guess you're right. Pancakes. Ice, ice cream, cream. School bus. Bounty balls. SMLMerch.com. Link in the description. Super Califat looking because we had a dosis. Ah, you didn't say what I said. Ah, you didn't say what I said. No, you just went. No, you just went. You didn't do the thing. 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 You didn't do Mario, stop it! <laughs> Jeffy! I'm gonna hit you. I'm going to hit you. Mario, don't teach him that! I'm, I'm just gonna watch TV. I'm just gonna watch TV. <sighs> Hello there! My name is Chris Tallballs, and this is my Chris Tallball, and I can predict your future for five bucks! So come on down and get your future predicted and see where your life is headed. Ooh, Mario, we should go see him. He could tell us our future. I'm not going to go see a guy named Chris Tallballs. He sounds like a kook. Chris Tallballs is not a kook. He's a pioneer. He's been telling futures for over 50 years. Well, I don't want to know my future, but hopefully Jeffy's not in it. Mario, don't say that. That's rude. Yeah, Danny, that was pretty rude. Oh, so you're done repeating me. Oh, so you're done repeating me. But no, Jeffy, you can't just start back up. Uh, no, Jeffy, you can't just start back up. Please, Mario, it would be so much fun. No! No! Mario, please go with me. I don't want to go. I don't want to go. See, look, Jeffy's on the right page. See, look, Jeffy's on the right page. Come on, Jeffy. We should all go together. Well, I want to go. Well, no, I don't. No, I don't. Well, which one is it, Jeffy? Do you want to go or not? Yeah, I want to go. But I don't want to go. But I don't want to go. Jeffy, make up your mind. I do want to go. I really, 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 really don't want to go. I really, 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 really don't want to go. See, Mario. see, see, Jeffy doesn't want to go. See, 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 Jeffy doesn't want to go. If I can convince Jeffy to stop repeating you, will you go? Yes. Yes. Jeffy, stop repeating Mario. All right, mommy. It, was that easy? Let's go! Baby. <sighs> All right, now I'm going to predict your future. Yes, it says here that you're going to be very rich and wealthy. I knew it. All right. Who's next? Come on in! <sighs> hey there, kook. Mario, don't be rude. Five dollars. What? Five dollars? Oh yeah. Here's your five dollars. Oh, wonderful. Oh, come on now. Come here, you. Oh, the friction is non-existent. Oh, you know what? Do away with that. Oh, hello there! My name is Chris Tallballs, and these are my crystal balls. Oh, I get it. What? Your name is Chris Tallballs, and those are crystal balls. It's the same word. It's not the same at all. Y y yes, it is. Your name is Chris Tallballs, and those are crystal balls. Correct. Yeah, so you did that. To, you, you, you named yourself that to, to sound like crystal balls. No, my name is Chris, last name Tallballs, and those are my crystal balls. Yes, but like it's supposed to it's supposed to be like a, a joke like to sound like crystal ball. No, there's no correlation there. Mario, I think you're overthinking it. What? No, his name is Crystal Balls and those are Crystal Balls. That would make sense if his first name was Crystal and his last name Balls, but his first name is Chris, Mario. It doesn't make sense. Well, it, it, his, your name is Crystal Balls. Tis, and those are my Crystal Balls. And they sound the same. No. Oh, you know, just tell me my future. All right. What's your name again? M Mario. Yes, I knew that. All right, here we are. Oh, oh, Ma Mario. Yes. He uh, your name. Yes. All right, Mario. Your future is you're going to be bald. He is bald. Ah, correct. 
wonderful. What, I've, I've always been bald. That's not even a future. All right, who's next? Me, me, me. Oh, wonderful. Five dollars. Oh, I only have a ten. Oh, perfect. You'll get two for the price of two. All right, here we go. Hello there. My name is Chris Tallballs. What's your name, dear? Rosalina. Oh, Rosalina. Let's see. Let's predict your future. That's how I turn my balls on. Boo, 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 boo. boo. All right. Rosalina, it says here that you're going to be getting a, uh, 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 a haircut. <gasps> I was thinking about getting a haircut. Perfect. Wonderful. Who's next? Okay, come on. He, he just made up something. He just randomly said you're getting a haircut. Everybody gets haircuts. Mario, there's no way he thought I could possibly get a haircut one day. There's hair in front of your eye. He knows you need a haircut. I mean, correct. So who's next? Uh, well, she gets two. All right. So who's next? Well, how about you tell us your future since you know so much? Oh, wonderful. All right. <clears throat> What's my name? Chris Tallballs. Oh, you're, you're correct, sir. All right, here we are. Chris Tallballs. <clears throat> boo. Boo, 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 boo. Oh, it says here that I will pay off my tax debt and, and I'll have no more tax liens because I'll be making $5 by calling people out of fake future tellings. Yes. Okay, and who ate the donut? What? Mario, don't laugh. Who ate the donut? Did you, sir? What are you, what are you talking about? What donut? Oh, my apologies, guys. My, I have early onset dementia, and I just forget things almost instantly. Okay. Well, ha have a nice day. All right, who's next? But Mario, what about Jeffy? He would love this. He just admitted to conning us out of $5 of fake future tellings. Oh, come on, Mario. Jeffy would have so much fun. Okay, if you want to lose five of your dollars, then get Jeffy in here. Okay. Five dollars? Here, Jeffy, I got five dollars from your wallet. All right, thanks. All right, what's your name, son? Jeffy. All right, Jeffy, let's see here. Mm, boo, Jeffy! Ooh, blah, 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 blah. Boo, 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 Oh, oh, yes, your future telling, Jim Bob. All right, here we are. Oh, Jim Bob, it says here that you are going to uh, 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 die in your future. Die? When? Uh, it, it says here that it could be tomorrow or, or in two days or a year from now or, or five years from now or ten or twenty or thirty or forty or uh, who ate the donut? <laughs> Well, hold on, Jeffy. We don't say that word on YouTube. We say go to sleep forever. Well, Santa Claus said I'm going to go to sleep forever. Jeffy, you're not going to go to sleep forever. I mean, eventually you will, but not anytime soon, probably. Mario! When? I mean, honestly, it could be any day now, any second. I mean, we never know when our time comes. Uh, I don't want to go to sleep forever, Daddy. Well, look, Jeffy, the, the man's a kook, and he doesn't even know how to tell the future. He's just conning us out of money. He, he was just making up stuff. He was just saying obvious facts, like, obviously I'm bald, and obviously Rosalina needs a haircut, and obviously one day we're all going to go to sleep forever, including you. Well, I don't so the reason we called you is you really scared our son when you told $10. him. $10. I, I just paid you. You did? $10. <gasps> look, here. Okay, that's all the money you're getting, okay? Look. The reason we called you here is that we need you to tell my son that he's never going to go to sleep forever. But we'll all go to sleep forever at one point or another. Okay, well then tell him he'll go to sleep forever in like a hundred years. It's just not now or anytime soon. Okay, where is your son? Jeffy, get in here! What's up, Danny? Santa Claus uh, read your future wrong, so he wants to tell you something new. Oh, oh hey, Santa Claus! Hello there, Jeffy. All right, let's take a look at your future. Oh, boo, 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 boo. Yes. Um, excuse me, sir. What am I supposed to be doing again? Tell him he'll go to sleep forever in like a hundred years, just not anytime soon. Ah, uh, gotcha. All right. Uh, hurry up, Stiffy, here. Yeah. It says here that you won't go to sleep for at least another hundred years. No, 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 no. Go to sleep forever in a hundred years. Like... Oh, wonderful. Uh, oh, it says here that you won't go to sleep forever for another 100 years. So I don't have to be scared for another 100 years? Correct. Oh, thank you, Santa Claus. Oh, no problem, son. All right, let's see here. Uh, uh. All right, Crass. Today, we're going to be learning about recycling. Recycling is when you reuse something over and over and over again. 
like this water bottle. See, I've already finished drinking the water out of it. So instead of putting it in the trash can, I could reuse it. I could put more water in there and continue drinking out of it. Or I could even pee in it. I know the whole smell, but that's not a problem for me because I got a tiny egg roll. You know what I'm saying? Or if I'm really accurate, I could even poop in there and save thousands and thousands of gallons of water a year instead of flushing the toilet. Or I could just put more water in there and take a shower, you know? So, any questions, Crass? <laughs> I've been using the same water bottle for years, dude. I use it for everything. <laughs> I've been saving the planet, and I'm accurate. Oh, hey, teacher, can I go and put some drinking water in my water bottle? Yes, Joseph, you can fill up your water bottle. <laughs> Thanks, teacher. Oh, man, I'm so thirsty. Ew. 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 All right, Crass, and we also have a brand new foreign exchange student who came all the way from London, and his name's Harry. Come on in, Harry. Hello, everyone. My name is Harry. Jolly good seeing you all today. Ha! He sounds funny. Mm-mm-mm. Nothing like some recycled water. That's disgusting. Shut up. I'm trying to save the planet. Captain Planet. <laughs> all right, Harry. You can sit, uh, oh, in Cody's seat, because he doesn't like coming to class anyway. Jolly good. Hey, you can't take Cody's seat. Yeah, this is my seat. Not anymore, it's not. What the heck? Alright, Crass, you have a B. Upside down I. Test tomorrow, upside down I. And for every I written on this board, that's one question that's gonna be on your test. Any questions? What about the upside down eyes? Yes. Okie dokie then. Alright Crass, so you better study for this test tonight. And I suggest you study with someone smart, because you don't want to fail this big upside down eye test tomorrow upside down eye. Oh man, I'm gonna fail this test. I know, dude, me too. I could help you guys study. Shut up, Harry. You look like you have taco meat on your head. Well, my friends do call me Taco Head. And your voice sounds weird. It sounds like you have something in your throat. Yeah, you, you look weird too, but Joseph, we do need his help. We're not smart, and, and he does look smart. So, uh, Harry, come to my house and teach us to study. Okay, jolly good. All right, Harry, help us study so we can pass this test tomorrow. Yeah, Taco Head. All right, what is the subject the test will be on? Subject? Like math, or science, or history, or geography? Uh, I don't know the subject. Do you, Joseph? No, dude, I wasn't paying attention. I don't know the subject either. All right, then we'll learn everything. Learn everything? Dude, that's too much. Yeah, it's going to take all night. I don't have time to learn everything. What if we just guessed on the test tomorrow? Dude, what if we fail? You're right, we can't fail. I wish there was a button we could press that if we failed the test, we could just keep doing the test over and over and over again until we passed. Oh, like a redo button. Yeah, like a redo button. Well, I can invent one of those. Well, usually our friend Cody invents stuff. Okay, well, would you like to call Cody and see if he'll invent you a redo button? No. I didn't think so, because he's corn and tea. Yeah, he, he doesn't hang out with us anymore. All right, well, I'll get off to inventing the redo button. Yeah, go, go invent it. Can you even invent that? I hope so. All right, mates, I got your redo button. Why does it say no? Well, if you did something that you didn't want to do, you press it like, no, I didn't want to do it that way. And then you get a chance to redo it. It would make more sense if it said redo. Yes, but if you flip it over, it lets you know that it's on. Oh, uh, okay. Yes. So how does it work? So what you do is you go and fudge something up, and then you press the button like, no and you get a chance to redo it. I bet my mom wish she had that button. <laughs> you know, to which day I was never born. <laughs> yes, but unfortunately, it only works like in the past few minutes. Okay, so I'm gonna go test that with Chef Pee Pee. Okay. <laughs> hey, Chef Pee Pee, what are you doing? Oh, nothing, just making green beans. Hey, Chef Pee, what are you doing? Uh, nothing, just cooking green beans. Oh. Wait, what are you doing with the cheese grater? Ow! 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 I'm a cheese! Ow! Stop it, Junior! <laughs> <laughs> Junior, what are you doing? Gonna pour me some Minute Maid. It's already in the bottle. You don't need to pour it. Look, don't make a mess, okay? I'm not gonna make a mess. Junior, you're not even trying! Look, pour it in the cup! Pour it in the cup! And the green beans? No! What are you 
doing, Junior? I have a question, Chef Pee-Pee. What? Do you want mustard all over the kitchen? No, why would I want mustard all over my kitchen? Well, you got it. <laughs> Junior, no, please don't! I just cleaned up! Why are you doing this? <laughs> hey, Chef Pee-Pee. Hey, Junior, what are you doing? Oh, uh, nothing. Just gonna break this glass cup. Wait, what? Yeah. <sighs> The button works! It does, dude? Yeah, I messed with Chef Pee Pee and I broke a bunch of stuff and made him mad, but then I pressed the button. Junior! Why did you break that glass in the kitchen? Oh, you better clean it up! Chef Pee Pee, I'll clean it up in a minute. I'm with my friends. Oh, I thought you said you pressed the button. I did press the button. I just didn't press it the last time when I broke the cup because I thought it was funny when Chef Pee Pee was mad. Hilarious. Oh, uh, dude, I want to see the button work. Oh, Joseph, you have to see this button work. Ooh, I can call Heidi from our class and ask her to be my girlfriend. Wait, who's Heidi? Heidi Gosiki, the hottest girl in our class? Oh yeah, Heidi is hot. Yeah, she would say no if I asked her out, so I'll just keep pressing this button until she says yes. Dude, that always works. Yeah, no doesn't mean no. Did there, what are you doing in my laboratory? I love that show. Well, I'ma call Heidi. <laughs> All right guys, I'm calling Heidi, it's ringing. Dude, how did you get her number? I heard her giving it to someone else and I wrote it down. Hello? Uh, hey, Heidi. Who is this? It's me, Junior, the hot kid in your class. Hello? <sighs> oh, what happened? Did she say yes? No, she hung up on me. Oh, puppy cock. Well, we didn't do that yet. It was just a phone call. Hold on. Let's try this again. Hello? Hey there, sugar muffin. Uh, who is this? Who do you want it to be? Joseph? <laughs> Dude, what's she saying? Uh, no, Jerry's not here. Bye. She was asking for someone named Jerry. Oh. I have a very defined occipital lobe. Let's try it again. Hello? Uh... Hi. Hi. Who is this? Oh, it, it's a it's a friend of Joseph's. Oh, hi. Yeah, I was wondering if you'd be my girl. Heidi, Heidi, get off the phone. What, who's that? That's my dad. Heidi, you're not karaoke night. It's time to go to karaoke. I'm gonna sing "Put the Money in the Grave" by Drake. You know, uh, when I die, I put my money in the grave. I really gotta put a couple camels in their place. I've lapped other camels in the race. When I die, I put my money in the grave. You know the words. Come on, Heidi, let's go. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Uh, uh, let's try again. All right, guys, I think I got it this time. Hello? Hey, ugly. <gasps> oh, hi. Hey, yeah, I know you have a really ugly nose. Oh, my gosh. You have such a way with words. Your voice sounds like nails on a chalkboard. Oh, well, you sound really handsome. Yeah, you're really beautiful. Oh, bye. Ugh, I almost had her. Oh, fun fact. My glasses actually don't have lenses in them. All right, guys. Hopefully, this is the one. Hello? Hey there, baby. Who's this? The name's Junior. J.R. Junior. Junior? Like in my class, Junior? Put it on speaker so we all can talk. Well, shut up, Harry. Yeah, dude, I want to talk. Guys, shut up. Who is that? It's just my friends. We want to run a Thomas on you. <gasps> Ooh, I love trains. <laughs> 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 Bloody good time, yes? Choo-choo. Oh, well, Heidi, will you be my girlfriend? Sure. Yay! Okay, I'll see you at school tomorrow. Guys, I have a girlfriend! Oh, he's not good, dude. Oh, okay. All right, guys, so this button is really cool, and we're definitely going to pass that test tomorrow, so I'll see you guys at school tomorrow. Okay. Hey, hey. Oh, man, I'm so nervous about this test. Me too, dude. Oh, I'm going to drink some water. Don't be nervous, guys. If you don't pass the test, just hit the button and keep redoing it until you pass. Here, Junior, look what I drew you. Not now, sugar bosoms. I have to take this test. Aw, but I love you. Yeah, they all say that. Oh. Oh, don't press. oh man, I'm so nervous about this test. Me too, dude. Oh, I'm gonna drink some water. Don't be nervous, guys. If you don't pass the test, just hit the button and keep redoing it until you pass. Junior, look what I drew you. Uh, don't touch this button. Just back up. Get out of here. Okay. Oh, she doesn't want to redo it. All right, guys, let's take this test. Oh. All right, is everyone done with their test? Oh, uh, yeah, dude. Chip, chip, cheerio. I don't know what that means, but all right, everyone turn in your test. Okay. All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, you got an F. <sighs> All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, you failed. <sighs> I got another F. All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, you got a big old F. <laughs> Again? <laughs> All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, you got an A. Really? A big F. <laughs> 
<laughs> All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, guess what you got? An F. An F. <sighs> All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, guess what you got? I swear to God, if it's an F. It's an F. <laughs> All right, class, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, guess what you got? Please, God, please, God, don't let it be an F. A plus. <gasps> an A plus! Guys, I passed! I passed! <laughs> Oh no! All right, Crass, I'm gonna pass out your test. Junior, guess what you got? What? An F. Ugh. Ugh. That took forever to pass that test. Well, at least you passed. Dude, I wanna have some more fun with that button. Yeah, okay, uh, what's something we can do? Ooh, I'm gonna go mess with my dad. Oh, oh, yeah. Let's do it, dude. Man, oh man, I can't wait to watch Charlie and Friends. Oh, they're running the marathon all day. Oh, I love my TV. <sighs> Hey, Dad. Well, what do you want, Junior? You know you're not important. Uh, hold on, I gotta do something. <laughs> Junior, what are you doing? Hold on, Dad. What's wrong with you? Uh, that's it, Junior. You're grounded. No, I'm not. And I'm gonna break all your toys. The Starting with this one. No, no, no. Oh, no. Please work. Please work. Junior, come here. We're going in your room and breaking all your toys. No. <laughs> Harry, Harry, I need you to make another redo button. No. Hey, Daddy, what's this thing? Ew, Jeffy! Jeffy, don't touch that! It smells bad. Where'd you find that at? I found it behind the toilet. Well, put it back. What is it? It's a toilet plunger. What'd you do? Well, when there's poop in the toilet, you stick that in it. Why don't you just flush the toilet? Because sometimes there's too much poop in the toilet, and you have to get it out with that. So how do you use this? You just scoop the poop out and make a poop sickle? What? No! Why don't you just use a spoon? Or a fork? Or chopsticks? Because th that would be gross, Jeff. You're supposed to use that. So then how do you use this? Y you stick it in like this. That's what she said. What? No, Jeffy, flip it around. What, like this? Yeah, and then, and then you get on it and, and you, you, you do this. Oh, yeah, Daddy. Work that pole. What? No, no, Jeffy. Look, just put it back where you found it. Why? You don't like it? What? No, Jeffy, I don't like you it. You don't like it? Get it away from me, and Jeffy. And then you know. I don't like it. Oh, I gotta take a shower. Ew, my face. Ew, Jeffy, put that back. I'm gonna go wash my face. Just, just watch TV or something. Stop. You wanna smell it? Breaking news, okay? The lottery is at $100 million. And the winning numbers are 15, 22, 25, 59, 61, and 6. Good luck to whoever has that ticket. Hold on to it tight so it doesn't blow away in the wind. And that takes me to the weather forecast. It's gonna be windy, 100% chance of wind. Powerful enough to snatch a lottery ticket right out of your hand. A hundred million dollars is a lot of money. All right, I'm back. I just took the world's quickest shower. Mario, did you hear the lottery is at a hundred million dollars? It doesn't matter, it's rigged. Jimmy, stop it, go brush your teeth. All right. It doesn't matter, it's rigged. No one's ever gonna win it anyway. They do say it's the idiot's tax. What's the lottery? Well, Jeffy, if you have a piece of paper with those numbers on it, you win a hundred million dollars. All right, hold on. Where's my hundred million bucks? Well, no, Jeffy, it has to be a lottery ticket with those numbers, and it has to be before they announce the numbers. Well, how was I supposed to know what the numbers were gonna be before they even announced it? Well, you're supposed to guess. Well, I think the next one's gonna be four. Well, Jeffy, five more numbers and you might have it. All right, seven. What, no, Jeffy, there's no point in guessing. It has to be all... Sixteen. Jeffy, no, go buy a ticket if you go... Twenty-three. Gonna... It doesn't matter. There's not another drawing. Fifty-four. The next drawing's next week. Do it. Sixteen. Th well, maybe you won. Seven. Jeffy, look, look. It doesn't matter. It, it does not matter. It, the lottery, it, it, you have to be 18 to play it anyway. Well, what am I supposed to do with this thing? Go put it back behind the toilet. Look, go take out the trash. Do your chores. Well, well, if you want me to take out the trash, then you gotta come with me. Because you're trash. Well, Jeffy, I take you out. Jeffy, look, go put that behind the toilet and go take out the trash and do your chores. <sighs> okay, daddy. <sighs> Jeffy's so annoying. Oh, Jay, go! Late now! Go! <sighs> I gotta take another shower. <sighs> look for some meat. <clears throat> <clears throat> Toilet paper. Oh, 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 oh. oh man. Oh man, I hate taking out the trash. Let me see if I can make it from right here. Kobe! Yay, I made it! Oh, what is that? Let me see what it is. What is this thing?
It's just a piece of paper with stupid numbers all over it. Uh, I've already had two showers today. Want to make it three? No. Hey, dang, I just took out the trash. Good boy, Jeffy. Mario, could you imagine if we won the lottery? I know, a hundred million dollars, that would change our lives. But how would we have guessed the numbers 15, 22, 25, 59, 61, and six? <gasps> Wait a minute. <gasps> Wait, Jeffy, where are you going? Oh, Jeffy. <sighs> where is he? Where is he? Where's the winning ticket with the numbers on it? What is this? Oh, that's not it. Those aren't the winning numbers. Oh, where is it? Oh, where is it? What's wrong, Jeffy? I won the lottery, but I lost the ticket. <laughs> sure you did, Jeffy. Yeah, you and your big imagination. Oh, um, Danny, what happens when you win the lottery? You take it to the lottery office and they give you the money. Jeffy, where are you going? He's just being stupid. Just sit down, baby. Breaking news, okay? The winner of the $100 million jackpot has stepped forward. Come on in, Jeffy. What? Jeffy has decided that he does not want to claim the $100 million in cash, but he would rather have $100 million worth of bouncy balls because he doesn't want to pay taxes. What an idiot! Jeffy won the lottery, but he didn't take the money. He took the prize in bouncy, bouncy balls? <laughs> hey, Dad, you like all my bouncy balls? Jeffy, you won the lottery, you didn't take the money, you took it in bouncy balls. <laughs> Mario, what else do you expect? He's just a kid. He could have taken the money and he could have changed our lives forever. But dang, I did change our lives forever. We have more bouncy balls now than we ever did before. What are we going to do with all these bouncy balls, Jeffy? Bounce them? Oh, Mario, I like this one. <laughs> Jeffy, we could have been millionaires. Well, we are millionaires. We're just bouncy ball millionaires. I feel all sticky and gross. I need, I need to take a bath. I need to take a bath. I had two showers today, but now I need to take a bath. <laughs> Oh, I hate my life, I hate my life. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna take a nice warm bath and hold my head under the water until I can't breathe anymore. That sounds perfect, yeah, yeah. But, ah! Oh, Jimmy! You put bouncy balls in the bathtub today! Look, Mario, I'm collecting all the purple ones. That's great, baby. How was your bath, Mario? I didn't get to take a bath. Tell her why, Jeffy. Cause I put bouncy balls in the bathtub. He put bouncy balls in the bathtub. Oh. That's so cute, Jeffy! It is. Well, it's not cute! It's inconvenient! The bathtub is full of bouncy balls! Well then take a shower like an adult! Well, Mario, he's just being creative. He's not being creative. He ruined my life. Jeffy, why did you take bouncy balls instead of the money? Well, Daddy, what am I going to do with $100 million? Put it in the bank? Let it collect interest? What happens if the government shuts down or the stock market crashes? Then I lose all my money. So instead, I invest in something tangible. See these bouncy balls? This bouncy ball right here has got gold in it. Mm hmm It's gonna be the next Bitcoin. And when it blows up, I'm gonna be sitting pretty, Daddy. I'm gonna be Jeffy Bezos. You are so stupid. Mario! He is! I'm stupid! Who's the one that doesn't have bouncy balls? You! Okay, you know what? Yeah, fine. Let, yeah, let, let's just sort the bouncy balls and to different colors. That sounds fun, right? Okay, Mario, you can collect the blue ones. Yeah, you already gave me blue balls today, so yeah, let's start collecting the blue ones. Oh, ooh, ooh, I found another one. Yeah, let's do that. Instead of having $100 million in cash, let's just play with 100 million bouncy balls like little kids. See, ooh, look how fun this is. This ooh, is fun. Ooh. Yeah, it's fun, Dad. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Mm-mm-mm, -mm, I can't wait to heat up my pizza. Where's all these bouncy balls come from? I don't even care. I'm not even gonna let it bother me. Cause I'm not gonna clean it up. I'm just gonna get a drink from the refrigerator. All right, let's see what we have to drink. Oh, Where are all these bouncy balls coming from? Oh, Mario! All right, I'm almost done with my blue pile. I have so many different piles, Mario. Isn't this fun? No. Hey, Daddy, I'm collecting giraffe balls and yellow balls. That's real nice, Jeffy. Mario! What's wrong, Chef PB? Why are there bouncy balls in my microwave and in the refrigerator? Right here. That's me. Right here. Jeffy won the lottery, and instead of taking the money, he took them in bouncy balls. That's stupid! Yeah, and he decided to put the bouncy balls all throughout the house because he doesn't know where to store them at. Well, get them out of my kitchen! I'm not cleaning it up! Breaking news, UK! Due to people counterfeiting and printing their own money, the United States is no longer using cash as currency. We will now be using bouncy balls as a new currency. 
So if you want to buy something, you have to pay for it in bouncy balls. What? Bouncy balls can be used as money now? Uh, actually, never mind. I'll clean it up. <laughs> well, well, well. Who's the idiot now? Mario. We're rich! Yeah, well, we, we are rich! Actually, I'm rich. Well, I guess that's true. Jeffy, what do you want to buy with your millions of bouncy balls? Hmm. Take me to McDonald's! Alright, grab some bouncy balls. Welcome to McDonald's. How may I take your order? Jeffy, what do you want? Happy meal! Can we get a happy meal? Uh, yeah, it'll be four bouncy balls, please. Jeffy, do you have four bouncy balls? Right here. Pay the man. Yeah. Okay, then. Here's your happy meal, sir. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. That's ridiculous. All right, we're back. Did the bouncy balls work, Mario? What does it look like, Mommy? I got my happy meal, so I'm happy as insert S word. That's so cool. I can't believe you're rich, Jeffy. I stay rich, Mommy. Well, Jeffy, is there any way that Mommy and Daddy can borrow some bouncy balls to pay some bills? Sure, Daddy, but you can only have the bouncy balls that are not on this couch. <laughs> Oh my god, Jeffy Je Je has bouncy balls hidden throughout the house. Oh, he has like a lot in the bathtub. Uh, where else do you have bouncy balls hidden, Jeffy? Um, I got in the bathtub and um, the toilet. The toilet! Oh my god, baby, we're rich. There's like a million in the bathtub and there's probably like a couple thousand in the toilet. Hold on, I'm gonna use the ice cream scooper. I'm gonna get the bouncy balls. Come on. All right, there it is, the gold mine. I'm gonna start taking it out with my hands. No, Daddy, let's use this thing that you said works. <laughs> wow, Daddy, it's really getting them out of there, isn't it? I, I, I lied. Let's use, let's use our hands. All right. All right, baby. We just got these out of the toilet. We're rich. Ew, Mario. They're dirty. I don't care. Clean money, dirty money. I want it anyway. <laughs> Breaking news, okay? The United States is going back to using cash as currency because we realized that bouncy balls was a stupid idea. What? So these, these bouncy balls are useless? Aw, but they're pretty to look at, Mario. Hey, Daddy, I fixed your toilet plunger. Now it's easier for you to get the poop out. See, if you put it like this, you scoop up all the poop. Hey, Daddy, can we have pizza for dinner? No, Jeffy. Why not? Jeffy, use your inside voice. This is my inside voice. No, it's not. You use your inside voice. Jeffy, I'm only yelling because you're yelling. I'm only yelling because you said we can't have pizza for dinner. Well, I'm the adult, so I make the rules. Well, your rules suck. Well, Jeffy, don't say the S word. The S word? Suck? Yeah. Oh, I thought the S word was yep. Chicago. And I hear they have good pizza there, and that's what I want for dinner. Well, well Jeffy, Chicago starts with a C, and you shouldn't say the C word either. Oh, I thought the C word was Kentucky. And they have fried chicken there, which is what I don't want for dinner. I want pizza. Well, well, Jeffy, Kentucky starts with a K. Oh, it starts with a K? I thought knife started with a K. Jeffy, that, that's pronounced knife. Um, no, it's pronounced knife. See, this is the word knife right here. See, it has a K right there. Well, Jeffy, it's pronounced knife. No, it's not. There's a K, so you pronounce it knife. Well, Jeffy, the K is silent. You, you want to know what's not silent? What? My inside, boys, because I want pizza for dinner. All right, Jeffy, look, I'm going to go in the kitchen and see if I can find pizza, okay? And if you don't find pizza, then you're going to hear more of my inside voice, because I want pizza. All right, Jeffy, I'll go find pizza. Good. I'm going to go talk to Junior. Tell him we're having pizza for dinner. <sighs> <sighs> okay, I'm finally done inflating my big inflatable airplane. I'm so lightheaded. Hey, Junior, guess what we're having for dinner? Because of me. What? Pizza. Oh, yeah, I love pizza. We're having pizza for dinner because of Jeffy. How'd you get that to happen? Well, Junior, I used my manners. I walked up to my daddy and I said, Father, may we please have pizza for supper? And he said, No, Jeffy. And I said, Catch these hands. Hold my weed, daddy. And so we started throwing hands. And long story short, we're having pizza for dinner. Oh, my God, I love pizza. Well, well you want to go throw this big inflatable airplane around? Yep. All right, let's go do it. <laughs> What's up, Mario? Oh, hey, Bowser. What'd you get to eat? Homemade cheeseburger and fries. Chef Pee, Pee went all out. Oh, well, I'm going to see if Chef Pee, Pee can make me some pizza. Oh, cool. Hey, quick question. Are you still jealous about my first place Mario Kart trophy? No, I'm not jealous about it, Bowser. That was years ago. Yeah, you're still jealous. <laughs> it's a prized possession. Maybe one day you'll get a first place trophy. I have plenty of those. Yeah, not this one. <laughs> I'm going to go up to my room. <laughs> All right, Junior, you ready to send it? Yep, runway 69 is ready for landing. 69er, prepare for both devices to be satisfied. <laughs> oh no, my dad's trophy! Houston, we have a problem. But that's space, Jeffy, not airlines. Boop, boop, pull up. Boop, boop, pull up. Yeah, that's airlines. <laughs> oh no! 
know. My dad loved this trophy. Obviously not, because he had it sitting on an airport runway. Yeah, we were cleared for landing. It was kind of irresponsible. What was that noise? That sounds like my trophy. Uh, Ron, Jimmy, my dad's coming. What was that noise? <laughs> my trophy. Who would do such a thing? What was that noise? Oh, you! I knew you were jealous of my trophy! Well, I didn't do this! Then who did? Well, someone probably threw that big inflatable airplane at it! Yeah, you, because you were jealous! Well, no, I don't even know where to get a big inflatable airplane like that at! I don't even know where that came from! Probably online! You probably went to Amazon Prime and it had it shipped here! I don't know if you have a membership or not! Well, look, I, I did not do that! I don't know what happened! Then who did? Well, Okay, well, maybe someone broke into the house and threw that plane at your trophy. Broke into the house, brought an inflatable plane, and threw it at my trophy? Yeah, maybe they were trying to distract you so they could steal your TV or something. Distract me for my TV? Wait, that does sound realistic. You know what? I have to put up some cameras because this, this world is getting dangerous. Well, no, 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 Bowser, obviously I'm lying. Maybe one of our kids threw it. No one broke in the house and threw a plane at your trophy. Look, look, look. Somebody's trying to steal my TV. I got to get some cameras now, Mario. Well, well, look, I'm going to tell my son to stay inside for the rest of his life. You do the same for your son, okay? Because this world is too dangerous. Oh, oh. Unless you just want to admit that you broke it. Well, I, I did not break it. I'm going to go tell my son to stay inside forever, too. Hmm. Exactly. Oh man, Jeffy, I can't believe we broke my dad's trophy. Do you think he noticed? No. Junior! Yes. Uh, Junior! Oh, uh, uh, don't forget to use your manners, Junior. What is the matter, Father? Look, Junior, I want you to stay in the house for the rest of your life. But why? Because somebody broke in and threw an inflatable plane and broke my trophy. Uh, well, what if hypothetically me and Jeffy did it? Oh, I would just send you back to military school. Well, we definitely didn't do that, did we, Jeff? We didn't do that. Nope. Mm -mm. Well, I'm glad to hear it. Look, Junior, it's a dangerous world out there. I just don't want you to go outside ever again. I'm going to tell Chef PP to let me know if you ever do so you can go to military school, okay? Well, that sucks. Hey, hey, hey. Don't use the F word. You know what? Stand in the corner. <sighs> yes, sir. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Jeffy, I need to talk to you. What is the matter, father? You're not allowed to go outside ever again. That's fair. But while we're making up these BS rules, you're not allowed to talk ever again. Jeffy, I'm being serious. Me too. Stop talking. Jeffy, I can talk. Shut up. Jeffy, I am allowed to talk. hush. I'm allowed to talk. Shut up. Jeffy, I can talk. No, you're not. Stop talking. Well, then you're not allowed to talk. Okay, Jeffy, we can talk. Dang, shut your mouth. Jeffy, I can talk. Stop talking! Okay, then you can't go outside. Okay, that's fine, so shut up. Okay, good, we, we, we got Stop enough. talking, Dad, I don't understand why you keep talking. Oh, we have an agreement. Shut your mouth. Just don't go outside. Hush! There, the security camera set up. Now we'll know if anyone's trying to break in and steal my television. I don't think anybody wants your television, Bowser. Oh, I know they do. I want to watch my Charlie, though. They can have it. <laughs> hey, Junior, how long are you in the corner for? I don't know. Well, why don't you just leave? I can't. Sure you can. All you gotta do is just get up and walk away. Hey, uh, hey, Junior? What? Joseph huh, is calling. Joseph's calling? Okay, I have to answer. I have to leave the corner and answer it. Mm -hmm. Uh, hello? What's up, dude? What's up, Joseph? Say what's up, Jeffy. Shut up. Dude, hurry up and get to the playground. Underneath this slide, I got tacos and chalupas. What, tacos and chalupas? I love tacos and chalupas. I'll be right there. <sighs> What, dude? I'm not allowed to go, Joseph. Wait, why? My dad said I'm never allowed to leave the house again. Dude, just sneak out or something. Oh, oh hey, look, Joseph. I'm gonna go ask my dad for permission, and if he says yes, I'll come. Oh, dude, hurry up. The tacos and chalupas are gonna get cold. Okay, I'll be there no matter what. I'll be there soon. All right, Jeffy, we have to sneak out the house. I can't go, Junior. Why not? Because I made a deal with my daddy that I won't leave the house if he doesn't talk anymore. And that's a pretty sick deal. But, like, come on. It's, choco it's tacos and chalupas. Hmm... But it's also my daddy not talking anymore because his voice is annoying. But it's tacos and chalupas under the slide. Hmm. All right, let's do it, Jay. All right, let's go. Let's sneak out. Oh, man, Jeffy, I can't believe we're sneaking out. I know. Our parents are so stupid. I know. They actually think that we're going to listen to them and not sneak out of the house. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, nothing. All right. Uh, let's go beat Joseph. All right. 
What's up, Joseph? What's up, dudes? Oh, you were able to sneak out the house? Well, our parents said no. But we said yes. Oh, ho, ho, that's sick. We'll help yourself to some tacos and chalupa. Man, Joseph, that's a lot of Taco Bell. I know. My cousin works in the drive-thru, so you know I'm hooked up. My butt hole's about to be on fire tonight. Oh, do you have any hot or mild sauce? Oh, bro, I have some fire sauce. I'm about to poop all over the toilet seat tonight. Yeah! But I was going to do that anyway. Oh, man, I can't wait to poop in the bushes. I can't wait to clog the toilet and make Chevy be clean it. <laughs> Let's eat all these tacos. Yeah, dude, tacos. <laughs> oh, man, Joseph, these tacos taste amazing. Yeah, these tacos taste pee-pee. Well, I don't want to eat it if it tastes pee-pee. <laughs> Get it, guys, because it's pee-pee? Well, speaking of pee-pee, Chef Pee-pee's calling me. Oh, everyone, be quiet. I have to answer the phone. Okay, dude. Uh, hello? Oh, these are good tacos. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Junior, where are you? Uh, I'm in my room. In your room, huh? Yeah, I'm in my, I'm in my room, just laying in bed. Stop lying, Junior. I know you're not in your room. I'm in there right now. Well, are you sure you're checking the right room? I'm in the room right now, Junior. Uh, oh, uh, well, uh, I'm sorry I lied. I'm on the roof. What? what, what? You, you know you're not supposed to leave the house, Junior. Well, your dad said you can't leave the house, so get back inside. Oh, okay, I'll be back in like 30 minutes. Look, you have 10 seconds to get back in this house, or I'm going to tell your daddy. <gasps> Joseph, oh, we gotta go. Jeffy, come on, go, go, go. Oh, okay, dude. Okay, Jeffy, we have to get inside before my dad notices. I can't believe all this is happening just because we broke my dad's trophy. What are you waving at? Ah! What is that? Is that a security camera? I think so. Oh, no. Jeffy, we have to break that. My dad cannot hear what we just said. I'm on it, Junior. Yeah, break it. All right, Jeffy, I need you to break that security camera. All right, Junior, I'm gonna use my Fortnite pickaxe. All right, break it. All right, here we go. You ready? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I, I think it's broken. All right, good work, Jeffy. Now let's get inside. All right. All right, Jeffy, we made it back inside the house and we didn't get caught. Junior, we were too smooth. There's no way we're going to get caught. Well, well, well. Uh, Junior, where were you? Uh, me and Jeffy were playing hide and seek in the attic, which is still inside the house, so we didn't, we didn't go outside. Oh, really? Well, Chef PP showed me this video, and I am disappointed. Oh, man, Jeffy, I can't believe we're sneaking out. Uh, I know, our parents are so stupid. Stupid, huh? I think we're going to listen to them and not sneak out of the house. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, nothing. All right. You were waving at the camera? Uh -huh. Okay, Jeffy, we have to get inside before my dad notices. I can't believe all this is happening just because we broke my dad's trophy. Uh, what are you waving at? Ah! What is that? Is that a security camera? I think so. Uh, oh no, Jeffy. Dad, break that Dad that's not me. Just... No, no, shush. I want to hear it. You're breaking it. All right, Jeffy. I need you to break that security camera. All right, Junior. I'm going to use my Fortnite pickaxe. All right, break it. All right, here we go. The pickaxe, huh? Nice. Junior, you know you're grounded, right? And you're going to military school. But no, Dad, that wasn't us. That was someone trying to frame us. Oh, don't lie to me, Junior. Uh, don't lie to me. You broke my trophy, and then you're going to break my camera, too? Well, I mean, uh, Tyler, Tyler, I don't want to hear it. Technically, you. I didn't break the trophy. Jeffy did. Way to throw me under the bus, Junior. You know what, Junior? I'm just so mad. Go and stand in that corner right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. And while you're standing in the corner, I'm going to get the number for the military school. I'm sorry you're standing in the corner, Junior. Uh, what's going on in here? Junior broke my trophy. But he broke your trophy? Excellent. <laughs> um, Danny, I don't think my friend getting in trouble is worth this hundred bucks, so you can have it back. Wait, Jeffy, stick to the plan. Wait, what plan? You better tell him the truth, Danny, before I do. Uh, uh, uh Debbie doesn't know what he's talking about. Uh, J Debbie needs to shut up. I, 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 you need to tell him, uh, Danny. Uh, 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 tell me what? Okay, fine, Bowser. I was jealous of your trophy. Wait, you were? I, I knew you were. And... and and I'm the one who broke your trophy. Wait, you broke it? I thought Junior broke it. No, I framed him. I made it look like your son did it. See, the truth is, I sent uh, an inflatable airplane to your son in the mail, and I knew he was going to invite Jeffy to play with him. And then when Jeffy had the airplane, I, I paid him $100 to throw it at your trophy. And then when the trophy hit the ground, it didn't break. So I took the hammer to it. I, I'm a fraud. I, I'm jealous of your trophy, and I can't pay my house payment, but I'm somehow slipping Jeffy $100 bills. How am I doing that? Yeah, so I was jealous of your trophy, and I just didn't want you to know. Well, I'm just glad you admitted it. <laughs> You were jealous, you were jealous. I'm forever number one, so it doesn't matter if it's broken or not. <laughs> Guys, am I still grounded? Or
All right, guys, are you ready? Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, Junior, let's send it. All right, Jeffy, you go first. Bim, 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 bim. Whoa. Yeah, Junior, it's a phoenix. All right, my turn. All right, let's see what happens. Yeah, yeah it's like a robot. That's awesome, dude. Okay, now it's time for my Pegasus. Boom, boom, boom. They are so cool! I bet mine could be used in a fight! Oh no! Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, hold on, there's someone at the door! Oh, hold on, let's go see Andrew. Uh, hello? Wait, oh, Roy! Get hard! Roy's the name, getting hard's the game. Joseph, Roy, get hard's at my house right now! Dude, what is Roy get hard doing at your house? Roy's the coolest kid in school! I know! Even cooler than PJ Crenshaw. Wait, Jamie Jam's Crenshaw? Pair of Jamie's Crenshaw! Oh, man! Oh, what do you think Roy wants right now? I don't know. We should ask him. Okay, uh, uh Roy? Uh, uh, Mr. Gighart, can I have your autograph, please? Joseph, do not embarrass us like this. We want to be like him. He's super cool. But, dude, it's Roy Gighart. Uh, Roy, uh, what are you doing here right now? Well, throwing a super cool party at my house. Parents are out of town for the weekend. Wait, 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 wait. Roy, are you inviting us to your party? <laughs> oh, no, not you, losers. I'm here to invite Jeffy. Wait, Jeffy? But he's a loser. Yeah, no. we're, we're, we're cool. No, I decide who's cool. Roy Gidhart always decides who's cool. You guys are losers, and Jeffy's cool. So come on, Jeffy. Let's go to my party. I got Wicked Capri Sun. What? 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 <sighs> Oh man, I can't believe that just happened. I know, dude. Roy came all the way to your house to tell us we're losers. Oh, this is the best day ever. But Joseph, that's not a good thing. I want him to think that we're cool. But dude, the fact that he even knows we exist, that means we're getting somewhere. But that does not mean we're getting somewhere, Joseph. I want to go to that party. But dude, don't question Roy's decisions, okay? He went to a Super Bowl and didn't have to pay for anything. I know, I want to be like that. I do too. Oh, it's just so cool. I, I just want him to invite us to the party. I want him to think that we're cool enough to go to his party. Well, we're not cool enough, dude. <sighs> yeah, when Roy says we're cool, that's when we're cool, but let's call Cody and see what he says. Okay, dude. What's up, Junior? What's up, Cody? Wait, wait, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just at this party. What, party? What, whose party? Yeah, Roy's party. Roy's party? What? what? Yeah, didn't you get invited? Uh, uh, did we get invited? Um, uh, um, uh, yeah, 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 we did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we totally. got, we totally got invited mm -hmm. to that party. Yeah, he invited us. Well, like, why didn't you guys come? B because um, we just, we just thought it would be lame. Oh yeah, yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, it's not lame, I can tell you that. They got a balloon. It's pretty cool. Uh, well, 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 balloons? well we, 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 we thought we'd be fashionably late, you know, like like so late that we don't even show up. Th that kind of late. That's too bad. You guys should really come. Anybody that's cool is here. Well, yeah, I know, and, and that's why Roy invited us. He said that we were super cool. Oh, yeah. And he said that we were the coolest people in the world and that he definitely wanted us to be there. Oh, yeah, he was begging us. Uh, begging. He's begging so much. Hey, Roy. Uh, Roy? Roy? Uh, uh. Roy? Roy, did you invite Junior and Joseph to the party? Uh, no. They're lame. What? Do you hear that, dude? Uh, 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 Cody, uh, we gotta go. Yeah, bro. Uh, we, we gotta go. Bye. <laughs> Joseph, Cody got invited to that party and we did it. Oh, dude, Cody's so lame. I know. Now I'm mad. Joseph, Joseph, I don't understand. How was Cody invited to that party and we weren't? We're normal. Cody's weird. Something does not make sense. Look, we're going to that party. Dude, we weren't invited. I don't care if we weren't invited. We're gonna sneak into that party. Well, how are we going to sneak in, dude? Well, we're like a disguise, like a costume. Wait, wait. If we have to wear a costume, we weren't cool enough to get in in the first place. But look, we'll, we'll go to the party dressed up as like a, in a costume and then when they say oh my god who's those two cool kids dressed up in costumes we'll take our costumes off and they'll say oh my god that's junior and joseph they're so cool we should have invited them mm, i guess that, that, that does sound like a good plan yeah, so let's go sneak into the party okay and we're gonna be cool let's do it oh, okay if cody can get in we can get in all right joseph we're here at roy's house we're this close to getting into the party oh dude i really hope we get in yeah so what are our fake names oh um my name is archibald i come from a wealthy english family okay and my name is benedict uh cucumber back Ooh. and i I, 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 my parents are billionaires. Oh, I like that. All right, so I uh, stick to your script. Okay, okay. I'm coming, I'm coming. Hello. Oh, All right, I mean, uh, hello there, mate. How's the weather up there? Yes, we are from uh, British land of of London. Mm hmm And we heard there was a hoot nanny going on up in, in their house. So we came to see what the hullabaloo was about. Uh, Junior, Joseph, I know it's you just wearing fake mustaches, and you're not allowed at my party. Do he know our names? Oh, he knew it was us. Oh, oh. oh. Uh, I can't believe we didn't get into the party. It's because we're lame, dude. We should get lame tattooed on our forehead. Joseph, we're not lame. Then why aren't we at the party? Because we're lame. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> you know what, Joseph? No. Screw that. We're, we're not lame. Well, we're not at the party. We don't have to be at that party, Joseph. You know what we're going to do? We're going to throw our own party. And it's going to be an even bigger, better, cool party than Roy's. Because Roy's party is stupid and dumb and awesome and cool. And ours is going to be better and bigger. We're going to throw our better party than Roy's. And then everyone's going to come from his party to our party. And they're going to say, Roy, your party's stupid compared to Junior's. And then when Roy comes to our party begging to get in, we're going to say, Roy, you're a loser. And we're going to slam the door in his face. Wait, you can't do that to Roy. Yes, we can because it's going to be our party. We're going to gonna say who's cool. We're gonna make the rules. Roy can't tell anyone who's who's cool and who's not cool. Well, am I invited? Well, of course you're invited, Joseph. It's our party. Yay! We're gonna be so cool, all the girls are gonna want to take us to the Super Bowl and not make us pay for anything. Oh, dude, I've been waiting for that. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna be the cool ones. We're, we're gonna throw the big party and we're gonna put it on on, on chat snap and, and Insta Omegle and we're gonna, we're gonna post on all the social media stuff and everyone's gonna say that's a cool party. Are you down? Oh yeah, dude. We're the cool ones. We're gonna get all the girls. We are. We're gonna Let's get free do. Super Bowl tickets. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Woo! Well, let's go throw a party. Yeah! All right, Joseph. I found us the perfect clown for our party. Screwball. <laughs> oh, really, dude? My clown's way better. His name is Butterball. Hey, kids. I'm Butterball. What, Butterball? What a lame name for a clown. Screwball's a better clown than Butterball. Dude, Screwball looks like he just got out of jail. How'd you know? Well, Butterball looks like he pays his taxes. Uh, because he does, he has a very sophisticated Job. Well, let's just go with Screwball. Screwball's a way better clown than Butterball. No, dude, my clown is way better. Well, no, my clown's way better. Dude, my clown's way better. My clown's way better. Butterball's way better. Screwball's way better. No, my clown's no, not. I want to go my better. No. Hey, kids, I got a way to settle this argument. Me and uh, me and old Butterbean over here can have a. Uh, <sighs> Screwball. Huh, huh, you were saying huh. you were saying something. Oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah. Me and Butterbean can have a, a balloon animal competition, and whoever makes the better balloon animal is the better clown. <gasps> that sounds like a perfect idea. Let's have a balloon animal competition. Are you down, Butterball? Oh yeah, I like that. Alright, so yeah, whoever makes the best balloon animal wins. Say less. Let's go. Alright. Alright, guys, time's up. Time for you to show me your balloon animals. Butterball, you show me yours first. It's a giraffe! Whoa, you made a giraffe? Mm -hmm. That ain't nothing. Hey, get it. Pull this. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, my. Uh, it's a snake balloon. I think we got a winner. Okay, hold on. Let me evaluate it. I'm the judge. Okay, we got a snake balloon and we got a giraffe balloon. Mm -hmm. Okay, I made my decision. After looking at how much time was put into both these balloon animals, I definitely think a hundred percent that mm -hmm. the snake balloon wins. You got to be kidding me! What? I went to ten years of clown school. Oh, I, he only did was pull that up. He didn't even band it. Well, you know what? I'm out of here. But but the snake balloon is, is so much cooler, right, Joseph? I mean, it was pretty cool, dude. Yeah, like, Screwball, you're gonna be our clown for our party, okay? All right, sounds good, kid. All right, so now all we need is games for our party. So let's get some games. Oh yeah, let's get some games. All right, Joseph, are you ready to see my cool party games? Oh, yeah, dude. Wait, what's the first game? It's called Limbo. Limbo? What are you doing Limbo? You have to try to walk under this stick. Dude, I'm not a caveman. Why would we walk under sticks for fun? It's not 600 BC. Well, look, 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 you just have to see how low you can go. Like, do you think you can go this low? No, I'm not going to try it, dude. It looks lame. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So, that, that game is lame, but watch this. I have an inflatable donkey, see? And you turn him around. Okay. And he has a target on his butt. And then you have to pin the tail on the donkey. Nobody wants to play pin the tail on a donkey. That's a five-year-old game. Are you five? Well, it's a really cool game. They play at a birthday party. <laughs> it's not at Roy's birthday party. He has kissed the hot girl on the mouth, not pin the tail on a donkey. Oh, okay, I'll give you that. That is kind of a five-year-old game. But, yeah. wa but watch this. Roy does not have this at his party. I have a pinata. And it's Peppa Pig. <laughs> Okay, this is the coolest thing you've shown me. Women love Peppa Pig. Yeah, so that's gonna bring a lot of women to our party, right? Yeah, women galore, bro. Okay, so what else do we need at our party to be cool? Hmm. We need rappers, dude. Wait, like candy rappers? No, dude, like Drake and like Eminem. We need actual rappers. So if we had Drake and Eminem at my party, people would come over? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so how do we get Drake and Eminem to come here? Bro, it's really not possible. If you think we could get them, don't you think that Roy would already have them? Well, look, I think that we can get something similar to Eminem and Drake. Like, as long as we get something similar, it's not we're not gonna be liars. Okay, so what's similar? Show, I'll show you. 
Hey, Junior, what's up? I can't talk for too long, because if Roy sees me talking to you, he'll kick me out of the party. Wait, wait, is that a disco ball? Oh, yeah, some girl just showed up and gave it to Roy. Isn't it cool? What? No, I actually think it's really lame. That party seems lame. Well, it's not. It's actually pretty great. Well, I, I was just calling you to tell you that me and Joseph are throwing an even bigger, better, cooler party here at my house. Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. It's way better than Roy's stupid, ugly, dumb, cool-looking party. My, my party's amazing and awesome. Well, we have Peppa Pig. Oh, yeah. Peppa's in the house. Peppa Pig? Yeah, we have a big Peppa Pig pinata, and we got Limbo. You know, how low can you go under the stick? Yeah, I guess that sounds kind of neat. Yeah, so I was just calling to brag to you that, you know, we're having a blast here at my party. And, you know, if you want to come here instead, this would be a cooler party. Well, Junior, I got to go pretty soon because Billie Eilish is about to perform. I, I don't really know who he is, but that sounds kind of cool. Oh, well, 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 I have to go too because Eminem's about to perform at my party because Eminem's here. Junior, you don't have Eminem at your party. Cody, I swear to God on my entire life, I swear on Joe's life, I swear on your life, I swear on my own life, I have Eminem at my party. Junior, I heard the S at the end. You have the candy. No, no, no. I ha no. I mean, Eminem's looking like a candy because he's so fine. He's so hot. Mm -mm -mm. Junior, your party sounds like it kind of sucks. Huh? No, my party does not suck. We have Eminem and we have Drake. You don't have Drake at your party. Joseph, Google a picture of Drake. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. We we have Drake here. Uh, look, 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 look. There he is. Yeah, he's right here. Well, Junior, that's Drake Bell from Drake and Josh. That, that's a lame Drake. No, no, it's the coolest. It's a Google picture anyway. No, no, he's here and uh, he's he's living up the party. Uh, and anyway, uh, I just wanted to call and tell you how cool my party was. So. Uh, oh, oh, oh uh, Junior Roy's here. I gotta go. Oh, no, 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 Roy, no, Joseph, why didn't Cody believe our party was cool? Because it's not, dude. The only cool thing is. Pepper. I mean, I just want people to want to come to my house and hang out with it. I want to be invited to that party. We're cool, Joseph. We're the coolest kids in the world. Nope, Roy is. <laughs> I just, I don't know what to do. I just wanted to be cool and accepted to go to that party. I would have done anything to go to that party. You know, me too, dude. Who's at the door? I don't know. Uh, hello? Hey there, I need to talk to this kid's parents. The party he was at got busted by the corpse? That's me! I ain't doing nothing! Wait, Jeffy, Roy's party got busted by the cops? Yeah, apparently Roy broke into someone else's house and threw a party! It wasn't even his house! Oh, dude, that's so Roy! Roy's so cool! I know! I need to talk to this kid's parents right now! What, Jeffy, why are you in handcuffs right now? What happened? I ain't doing nothing! Man, what happened? He got busted at a party! What, Jeffy, you were at a party? Like, you know you're not supposed to be at a party. Come on, you're going with me right now. You're so, so grounded! What? Joseph, look, Jeffy just got grounded. It's a good thing we didn't go to that party. I know, I wish I did, though. I mean, sometimes it's good not to be cool, you know? I mean, we had a lot of fun at home together, so sometimes it's not that important to be cool. Yeah, I guess so.